Peter Matia, a water and irrigation engineer from Match Water Solutions. I'm going to take you through a drip irrigation system that you have just installed here. This is our, our power source. We are using a solar pump. As you can see, this, uh, this is our, our solar panel. Uh, this is our controller. Uh, from this side, we are controlling it from here. Uh, this is a switch. You switch on from here and you switch off here. Then here, this is uh, this is our water source here. Uh, we are pumping water from the shallow well uh, using a solar pump. Uh, from here up the other side where we are going to irrigate. We are pumping water from our water source, the other side, as you can see, using a solar system. Uh, we take the water up from our water tank, this way, to irrigate two and a half acres of coffee, as you can see. All the garden is full of coffee. Uh, uh, the distance from our water source to our water tank uh, it is 200 meters at an elevation of 56 meters. Our water tank, it is a 10,000 liter tank, it is on the stand of one meter. Uh, the reason why we put it on one meter is because of the uh, slope here. The slope which is here is enough to uh, generate enough pressure. Uh, this is our inlet from the other side, it takes the in, in the tank. From there, we have our outlet which is the main for the drip irrigation system we are irrigating here. Uh, this is uh, our valve, uh, this is our filter, uh, the reason why we are using a filter is because of uh, we, don't w we need clean water but through the emitters so that it, it doesn't affect all crop the emitters. Uh, this is our mine, it passes through here and takes the other side, from there we are channeling water to the submarine. Uh, one of our submarine is here. And uh, this, this one is a control valve to take to one of the submain. You open, you open like this, then you close. If you need the water to flow this side, you open from here, it flows. Then if you don't need it, you want to get to other, other, the other side, you close here. Then the water goes to the other side. You have four submains. Uh, from there, we are channeling water into... Uh, into ratelos. Uh, how you connect into from submain to ratelos? Uh, you use you use the puncher to put a mach to put a hole. Then you put a rubber from there. Uh, you connect to our submain. Uh, we are connecting ratelos. How to connect ratelos? Uh, you make you. Make a hole on a submarine using a punch. You connect a rubber starter. You add a connector again, a rubber connector. You add a razor pipe, this one here. From there, use a straight connector to connect our laterals. Our, from our laterals, it's where we connect the emitters, where the, our coffee is. Each plant, on each plant, you connect the emitter. This is our emitter. We have different different emitters with, with different discharges, but uh, here we are using this emitter of a discharge 4 liters per hour, as you can see. Here is 4 liters per hour. It's the one we are using because of the crop we are irrigating and uh, the soil type. As you can see, on each crop we have emitter. Check each crop we have emitters everywhere we connected uh, this side and this side emitters in uh this side we have a distance of 25 meters and even this side we are connecting also distance of 25 meters for rattles we are going to open here our valve to see how the water comes out from the emitters all right as we told you, each emitter has a discharge of 4 liters per hour. As you can see, the water comes out very well. Uh, you can see it comes out very well. It irrigates direct to the root of the crop. 
no wastage of water. All the water is okay. Uh, the plants now they are enjoying, they are investing very well, as you can see everywhere. Come here and show them. Uh, here, you can see all the lines. Let us go this way. Uh, um, you can see it's getting very well. Uh, check everywhere. Uh, the water is coming out. Uh, you come and you see here, everywhere, you can see. The water is coming out very well. So, uh, if if you uh, when after irrigating and you see that all oh, uh, the crops, uh, our coffee has gotten good water, uh, you close this valve and you go to open other valves this side. You come from this side. The garden is big. The garden is big. Uh, so, since we have closed the other side, uh, we come on this. We have another valve. This is another sub main. So, we are tapping from the main. This is the main. Go, going the other side, we keep tapping. Uh, every After 50 meters, we put a sub main so that it can supply this side 25, this side, and even 25, this side. So once we open here, uh, the water flows and it starts irrigating all of this part. So you can see it has already started irrigating, but uh, uh, it is closed now. Let us go and show you another submarine. We had already irrigated this area, as you can see, so that's why we are not putting, like we are not uh, opening the valve. Now, I'm going to show you. You uh, can see the garden is big. The garden is big. We have here another, another submarine. This is another submain. So if we want to irrigate this area, 50 meters, this side 25, this side 25, we open this valve, then the water flows and we irrigate. Uh, come and we go. Go to the last. In the middle of, uh, of this, you come. area is very okay. You can see the garden is big. That is the last one. Last valve, eh? fourth valve. So uh, we are. This is our last part. This is 25 meters, and even this side 25 meters. So if we want to get you open here, the water flows. It starts. It starts irrigating from down. As you can see, after opening, it starts coming out. The water starts from down, then it comes this side and starts irrigating. It first fills all the pipes before it starts, then after uh, the water starts coming out. Yeah, you come. After opening the valve, you give it some minutes. Uh, it it fills all the 
this area then from there the water starts coming coming out as you can see the water has already started coming out yeah come and see Uh, we are irrigating this area. Yeah, very well. All right, all right. Uh, this is a uh, coffee garden. Uh, thank you. Uh, for more information, contact Mat Water Solution on 0760 224883. All you can check on our social media handles, uh, check on Google, Mat Water Solutions, check on YouTube, Mat Water Solutions, check on uh, LinkedIn and Twitter, Mat Water Solutions. Once you find this logo, just know, we are okay, we can do all, uh, we do all the services related to water and irrigation, like we install water pumps, irrigation systems, uh, plumbing services, rainwater vesting, Greenhouses, boreholes, shallow wells, solar water, solar water pumping, and all, all systems related to water and irrigation. Thank you very much. All right.